All right, let's make a set of bifold doors. And to do this, I'm going to turn my screen around just a little bit. Now, of course, you don't have to make these for this particular house. This video is strictly to show you how to make a set of bifold doors. And um, you will more than likely use this on your custom home when you get ready to um, you know, build your, your like pantry or a place for a washer and dryer. Um, place for a uh, your water heater and your air handler and things of that nature so to start with what I do my, my bifold doors in this case are gonna be a total of four feet wide so for <clears throat> for drawing purposes I'm gonna take a line I'm gonna find the center of this wall here and then I'm gonna draw it out just like that okay now my door is uh, four foot wide like I said so I'm gonna offset I'm going to offset that line two feet each way. So two feet this way, two feet that way. All right, and I can get rid of that center line. Actually, I'm going to keep that center line for now. I don't recall if I'm going to need that for uh, any other reference or anything like that. Um, now, bifold doors, um, what, what, the, what there is, is going to have like two sections here and then two door sections here. And you'll see what I'm talking about here in just a second. Um, but we draw those at a 45 degree angle. And I'm going to start with a rectangle. And because I'm drawing it at a 45 degree angle, I'm going to select um, this. Um, tracking setting to to track me at you know a 40 a 45 degree angle or including a 45 degree angle anyway so i'll start my door with a rectangle uh, my door is going to start right here that's basically where my hinge is going to be right, i'm going to draw up here at a 45 degree angle and let's see i'm going to place that at one foot Okay, that's going to be my x-axis. Okay, it wouldn't let me specify the other side. Okay, maybe we should just use lines here. Okay, we're going to use lines instead. Okay, so I'm drawing this line um, one foot long. All right, and then I come back down here at another 45 degree angle and draw that one one foot. All right, real simple. I'm going to do the same over here. Draw that one foot. And draw this one one foot. Okay, now we're almost there. Um, now what we want to do is we want to offset uh, those two shapes there. So we're going to offset uh, the thickness of the doors, the bifold doors, which would be probably about an inch and a half. So one dash one slash two inches. Select what I'm going to offset there. Oops, it went to the wrong side. Let me do that again. Does it want to go? There we go. All right, so there we go. We got two bifold doors. Now we just need to clean them up a little bit. We're going to use, uh, let's see, we're going to start with the delete tool. Well, actually, we're going to use the trim tool. Okay, you press enter to select all intersections. And these little spots in between here, we're going to get those, get those little lines there. Um, we're going to get that line, that line, oops, that line, that line, that line, that line, that one. Okay, and this one. And we're actually going to cut that whole line off there. All right, we're going to have to erase that particular line. All righty, and we're going to we don't want to erase that whole line. We want to trim that one. And then we can erase this one. Try it again. All right, now we have bifold doors. Oh, I forgot this line. Trim it. And there you go. 
and you could if you had like a beam or something going down the middle here to help support the doors you could actually draw that but you don't have to um, that right there pretty much tells um, the carpenters uh, what they're supposed to do there so there's your bifold doors